Hello. Hi, Mariano. Hi, Manuel. Doris. Hi. Hi, sir. Hi Debbie. ¿Cómo están? Bien, teacher. No sé qué tal. Bien, digo yo. Así como que con un poquito de, de frillito porque que ha llovido con... <risa> Todo el día. Sí, sí. Y así como bien cloudy. <laughs> cloudy. Yes, very good. Hello, hello, good evening. Hi, how are you? Nice to you. I'm okay. I'm, I'm, nice, I'm, nice. I'm at my home. Oh, home, sweet home. Home, sweet home. Yeah, no kidding. Very good. So how many days off do you have? Four days. Four. I work, yes, I work uh, some days. Okay. And then you work three days or four days? Four, uh, four days. So it's four days in, four days out? Yes, yes, four days in and out, yes. Very good. And then you switch four days at night and then go uh, back four days during the day. Yes, uh, this, this Sunday I work, I will work uh, uh, day shift. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. cool. Hold on, guys. I just need, yeah. Okay, so let's begin here, guys. I see everyone, well, a lot of people are joining us already. So Domingo, Gabby, hello, welcome. All right, Johnny, eh, Trini, Claudita. Okay, okay, Claudia, that's okay. Manuel and Carla, very good. Okay, guys, so we're going to continue. Um, yesterday, we stopped on would be better, ¿verdad? Eso nos quedamos ayer would be better, yes, and the activity that we had, let me just have it here, guys, please. It was this one, would be better. All right, so I have the questions here. Some of you did not finish answering the, I mean, telling me your sentences. Domingo, did you tell me your sentences, Domingo? Did you say? Sentences. Uh -huh. I say this. Uh, 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 okay. Uh, that number one is that thanks quite it will be will, will be better to start over again. Okay, very good. Another one. Tell me three sentences, Domingo, please. Three, three sentences. Yes, three. Ojalá, sí. uh, um, I, I, I think it's worth better, worth better, better to sleep for night. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. And one more. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I work. I will, I will be there to stay in house for precaution. Okay, very nice. All right, let's see. Um, yeah, uh, Trini, did you tell me your sentences yesterday, Trini? I think it will be it will be better to come on the weekend. Okay. It would be better to stay at the home so that it is not exposed. Ah, exposed. Exposed, yes. It would will, will be better for every everybody everybody uh -huh. to raise the salary. Oh yes. <laughs> that would be very very it would be very, very, very good. All right, nice. Thank you. Let's see. Um Walter, did you tell me your sentences yesterday? 
about would be better? Uh, I think it would be better to eat more vegetable and less fast food. Okay. Uh, it would be better to start home and keep distance for COVID. Okay. Uh, it would be better for everyone to practice exercise every day. Oh, yes. All right. Okay. It would be better if it wasn't leave the home ski inside. Okay. Funny. All right. Very nice. Thank you. Ever, did you tell me your sentences? Ever? Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening, yes, Ever. I did. You did? Yes, I did. Teacher. Okay, all right, very good, thank you. Ah, uh, es que no tomé la foto, eh. <laughs> A ver, ayer se me olvidó, pero ¿quiénes me faltaban? Um, Vane, I don't know, I don't know if you're driving, Vane, and I don't remember if you told me your sentences. Yes, I did, teacher. I'm okay. at home. Okay, all right, okay, that's okay. Gaby, yes, I remember Gaby's. Debbie, did you tell me your sentences? Sí, ¿verdad? Sí, ya me acordé. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, Johnny, yes. Yes. Yes, teacher. You did, okay. And Daniel, too, I remember. What about Manuel? Manuel didn't tell me his sentences, pero no sé si está por ahí, Manuelito. Uh, yes, teacher. Tell me. Sorry. No, that's good okay. evening. Good evening. Um, do you have your sentences from yesterday's class about would be better? Could be better. Uh -huh. Is the good it better to reduce the manual before printing? Okay. Yeah. Sí, pero era. Eran las, las que yo les presenté, ¿se acuerda, Manuel? En una PowerPoint. Ah, ok, ok. Ya, ya. Acá las tengo, permítanme. Ok, ya. Yeah. Que esa me la lleve para otro lugar. <risa> <risa> ok. Eh, I think it would be better to more exercise than diet. Ok. Ah, ok. Do you think it would be better for the environment to save rainwater? Oh, okay. Nice. I like that sentence, Manuel. Thank you. It would be better if it if, if wasn't to go to that concert. It would be okay. Okay. I was hoping it would be better the national team game. Okay. All right. Very nice. Thank you. All right. Thank, Thank you, you, Manuel. All right. Everybody else told me, ay, Jorgito va manejando en camino. Claudita is working. Creo que todos los que están aquí ya. Mariano, did you tell me your sentences? Yes, to sure. Yes, yesterday, right? Yes. Okay, very good. Uh, Leti and Roberto. Leti, sí, creo que me dijo las oraciones de ayer, ¿verdad, Leti? Good evening. Yes, teacher. Yeah. All right. What about um Roberto? Do you did you tell me your sentences yesterday, Roberto? Hello, teacher. Uh, no, I think no. Okay. Do you have them, Roberto? Yes. Sorry. Uh, uh, I I I opened the 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 file. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Thank you. Okay. Um. It's okay. Okay. It is about um. It would be or or not. Sorry. Yes. Yes. It is. It's about the presentation and my sentences. Uh, Roberto. Donde decía that's why it would be better to. Ah. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. That's why it would be better to work at home in these days yes i like your sentence <laughs> i agree with you mm -hmm. <laughs> okay the, the next one is i think it would be 
be better to rest properly. Okay. Go to bed early. Okay. Mm -hmm. It will it would be better to stay at home. It would be. It would be way much better to stay at home. Very good, Roberto. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Excellent, Roberto. Very good. All right, guys, I'm going to take attendance right now. And then we are going to do one more activity related to the would be better and related to the training manual. Y luego pasamos a lo demás que nos ya toca para este día. So I'm going to take attendance right now. Adela Trinidad González Consuegra. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Uh, Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Thank you, Claudia. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Debbie Jasmine Giron Ramírez. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candrae Montano. Present Thank you. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Present teacher. Carla Benacir Lara González. Thank you, Carlita. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. Thank you, Leti. Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. All right, Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. Maria Gabriela Batres Marmol. Good evening, present. Thank you, Mariano Jose Paca Santa Maria. Present teacher. Vanessa Noemi Reyes Lemos. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutierrez de Duran. Bismar Ulises Martinez Ortiz. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Presentation. Julio Cesar Vega Aguilar. Permítame, solo necesito hacer esto aquí. Uh, Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Present. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. All right, solo déjenme aquí tachar unos nombres. All right. <laughs> Teacher, Hello. I have a question. Yes, what's your question, uh, Johnny? Uh, with the first sentence, uh -huh. I don't know the meaning uh, I wrote. Uh -huh. I wrote it uh, because I know uh, the formula, uh -huh. <laughs> but I don't understand so well. The sentence of my PPT or my PowerPoint. Yes, that's why it why it would be better. That's I don't why know. It would be better. Okay, mm -hmm. muy bien, Johnny. All right. El that's why. Espérame, ahorita se las comparto so we can see it all together here. All right. So number one, ayer decía that's why. That's why it would be better too. Lo que no entiendes el that's why, Johnny. Uh, no entiendo en qué, se, en qué lo podría usar, porque como depende del contexto, tendría que haber dicho algo antes. Eso es lo que no entiendo muy bien. Ok, permítame, déjame su... Es que a veces son dos de un solo, Johnny, all right. No termina la cola, all right. Ahí viene otro. My goodness. All right, and, and, sí, usted tiene razón, Johnny. De hecho, en esta, en esta um, primera oración, tendría por lógica, Johnny, de haber algo previo, ¿verdad? Cosa que no hay porque no estamos construyendo una conversación o una historia. Pero la idea mía es la que como exponerlos a, la, a cualquier situación, digamos, donde podemos usar Dentro de la cual podemos usar, it would be better too. Entonces, tomando el caso, tomando el caso que usted y yo estuviéramos, estuviéramos hablando antes, ¿verdad? previamente. Entonces, usted me dijera, sí, dije, es que mira, así como está la situación eh, de peligrosa, ¿verdad? Y entonces yo le dijera, sí, Johnny, that's why it, it would be better 
to stay at home and not go out. ¿Verdad? Entonces, es como que ya veníamos platicando y de repente yo le digo, sí, cabal, por eso digo yo que sería mejor tal cosa, ¿verdad? Ah, ok, teacher. All right, yes. Thank you. Teacher. Dígame. Eh, no, domingo. Uh, ok. Por, el, por ejemplo, en el número 6, eh, yo le hice 30, me puse contexto antes. Le dice, life is complete, complete. I could be the better is, if, if I watch. Repítame lo que puso antes también. Eh, life is complete, complete, complicado. Uh, life is complicated. It complicated. Would be, ajá, it would be better if it wasn't. Y la dejó hasta ahí, ¿verdad? Ajá, uh -huh, yes. Bien. Usted le, lo que pasa es que usted le puso algo antes. All right, but that's okay. It's fine. Yes. All right. Okay. Yeah, very good. Um, Doris, what was your question? En la última, mm -hmm. I was hoping it, it would be better eh, en pasado, ¿verdad? I was hoping, yo esperaba. Entonces yo puse, I was hoping it would be better sold this month. Eh, mi duda es, sold lo puse en pasado, las ventas este mes. Así es, así sería. Fíjense que en esa, it was, ah, perdón, I was hoping, esa es la expresión, I was hoping si está en pasado. Ajá, ajá. Yo, es, yo esperaba, yo esperaba. Que Entonces fuera yo... mejor to have better sales. Uh, All right. I was hoping to yo... be better to have better sales. Uh -huh. okay. Ajá. Ah, entonces ahí tenía la duda porque yo solo puse, quiero ver better sold, pero ventas lo puse en pasado. This ah, month. Okay. All right. Lo que pasa es que ventas como nombre, Doris, es sales. Sales. Sold porque es sold vendido. vendido. Exacto. Ajá, Ajá el, el, ya es el pasado, el verbo en pasado. Pero si usted pone ventas como tal, es un sustantivo. Entonces sería sales. Uh -huh. Permítame. Sales. Uh -huh. Entonces sería, I was hoping it would be better to have But no, ajá. Ajá. Better say. Okay. Ahora, ¿se acuerdan ayer? It would be better if. Habían unas oraciones en el manual donde teníamos el if. Uh -huh. Ahí no me metí mucho porque eso todavía no lo hemos visto y es un tema para toda una clase que sería usando el if tercer condicional. Entonces, ese es más complicado. Porque el verbo que tenemos que usar después también me han pasado participio y no nos lo podemos todos. All right? Entonces, si usásemos ese, si usáramos eso, dijera, I was hoping it would be better if I had sold more. Ahí sí. All right? Pero es por la estructura, porque uh -huh. es el, el, el eh, como le digo, el condicional. Uh -huh. uh -huh. En pasado participio con Exacto. el have. Exacto. All right? Y usando el if. Por eso no me quise meter mucho. ¿Se acuerdan que ayer les dije, háganme oraciones, pero no les pedí que hicieran del if? Porque todavía no hemos llegado al tercer condicional. Okay. Right. Entonces ahí vamos a ponerle un alto. Pero sí, de esa forma lo puedo poner en pasado participio. Permítame. All right. Any questions? Any other questions about these sentences? No? Okay, perfect. All right, so let's go, let's continue here now with our books, with our manuals uh, here. Vamos a ver, so yesterday we did this exercise, all right? Espero que si trabajaron en la plataforma en ese ejercicio no les haya dado problema ya ni la dos ni la cinco, all right? Si en caso sí, revísala bien porque si ya está corregido el error que estaba, entonces ya no tendría que haber nada. All right. A mí siempre me salió y lo revisé bien. ¿En cuál, eh, Doris? ¿Cuál número? En la, en la dos y la cinco. ¿Será el apóstrofe que está usando Doris? 
¿Segura que está usando apóstrofe y no está usando la tilde? Mm. <risa> ¿Vos eh, yo, co, co, bye, voy a revisar, pero <risa> creería que sí, que es la apóstrofe, pero voy a revisar. Vaya, vale, revise y si no, con gusto yo le ayudo. Oye. All right, so okay. let's go back here now to page 23. Ah, no, ¿sabe qué? Vamos a regresar a la página 22 y vamos a hacer esto ahorita. Quiero ver. No, a la página 21 que nos quedamos pendientes con esto de acá. Let's start. Vamos a hacer esta. Eh, is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? Number one and number two. Do you think this manual can be improved? All right, so those are two questions in one. Question number one, is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? Number two, do you think this manual can be improved? That's question number two. Ahora, ¿cómo vamos a responder estas dos preguntas? All right, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. We're going to make a conversation. Donde estas dos preguntas van a ir incluidas. Okay, so if I am working with Mariano, la conversación empieza. Hi, Mariano, how are you? I'm fine, Jessica, what are you doing? Blah, blah, blah. A llegar a so Mariano, what do you think, por ejemplo, no? what do you think about the training manual? And you can say, ah, Jessica, I think the steps are not in the correct order. I think it would be better, y empezamos a usar el, el, el would be better. I think it would be better to change a step number four to number five. Y yo le contesto, really? Why do you think that would be better? Y Mariano me contesta. Y luego le digo, Ah, uh, okay. Uh, uh, Mariano me dice, what about you, Jessica? Is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? Y yo le contesto ya basada en mi realidad. Yes, there is a manual of pro with procedures in my workplace. Oh, really? Yes. Y luego Mariano me dice la otra pregunta. Do you think the manual can be improved? Y yo le digo, I think so. I think it would, y vuelvo a meter el, I think it would be better. Or that's why las oraciones que vimos ayer, permítame. Oh my goodness, no sé cuándo se acaba esto de los camioncitos, alguien sabe. <laughs> es como que, ah, I'm stressed, all right. <laughs> all right, entonces, la idea es incorporar dentro de su conversación, tal vez no los pasos, all right, pero sí como hacer referencia, ah, sí, yo quisiera, me creería yo que fuera mejor pasar el paso tal al paso eh, uno, all right, por tal razón, tratar de incluir estas palabras de transición, all right, y luego dentro de la conversación hacemos estas preguntas y seguimos hablando, ¿verdad? Siempre del training manual. Traten de poner tanta información de la que se ha visto como sea posible dentro de su conversación, pero estas dos preguntas deben de ir, el igual que el uso de wouldn't it be better, all right. Pueden tomar este como ejemplo, este training manual que está aquí, all right, para hacer la conversación de, de un lado y del otro sí lo tiene que contestar eh, verídicamente porque estamos hablando realmente si tiene o no su lugar de trabajo, un manual with procedures. Y si usted cree que puede ser mejorado o no. So it's a whole conversation, guys, okay? All right. Espero que haya, haya quedado claro, es una conversación donde tiene que ir esas dos preguntas hablando de training manual. Dentro de la conversación, trate de incluir, it would be better, all right, de las formas que la hemos visto. Trate de incluir las expresiones que hemos visto también de enlace, all right, para que tenga una conversation, like a very nice conversation. Igual, trate de hacerla en la compu, en la tablet, en el teléfono para poder compartir, ¿ok? Hoy no le vamos a dejar a Debbie el trabajo de escoger, sino que lo va a escoger Johnny. All right, necesito saber quién, no, quién va de camino todavía por cuestiones de, para unirlos a los grupos.
Claudita sé que está en el trabajo. Roberto, Leti, ¿ustedes sí pueden participar? Yes, yes teacher. Okay, very good. Eh, Carlos Eduardo and Manuel Antonio, can you participate? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Yes, yes okay. teacher. Very good. Vane and Carlita, can you participate? All right, okay, creo que ellas no. Ni Vane, ni Carlita, ni Claudia. All right, los demás sí estamos ahí. Let's go to our groups. Uh, son las prácticamente ocho y media. A las 8.45, trate de terminarlo para regresar. Yo lo es igual, yo lo saco de aquí. Carlita no puede. Y Vane, me, me, me confirma Vane si puede. Permítame. Eh, Carla y Claudia, si gustan, se quedan acá en, el, en esta sala para yo poder ver a quién muevo. Ok, y Jorgito, no sé si Jorge puede participar igual. Creo que no. Déjeme revisar algo, permítame. Doris y Debbie, si pueden. Hold on, guys, ténganme paciencia. Ah, ok. Ahorita no. Ok, creo que estamos, ahorita estamos con los que podemos participar tal cual. Ok, let's go guys.
teacher. Me ayuda, además, es que me, se me trabó el celular. Vale, vale. ¿En qué grupo en estaba? La, vale. En las cinco. Con Daniel y Walter. Uh -huh. Voy. Thank you. Thank you, Vane.
Hi, Miss Mar. Hi, Vicky. Yo sé que Hi, teacher. Un... Hola, hola. Eh, en unos dos minutitos saco a sus compañeros. Entonces, si gustan, me sigan, me, me esperan aquí, ¿ok? Ok, teacher. Okay, Gracias. Teacher. All right, guys, uh, let's continue. Did you finish your conversation? Yes. Excellent. More or less. More or less. Excellent, Doris. Very good. So All right. So, so, okay, that's good. That's okay. That's far. That's fine. Let's see. Um, Johnny, ¿dónde está Johnny? A ver, tenemos seis Hello. minutos, Johnny. Tell me one number, please. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, don't I don't remember my, my number. No, no importa, mejor cualquier otro. <laughs> number three. Number? Three. Number three. Manuel, Mariano, and Roberto. Siempre, siempre salen primero, ¿verdad? Primero, teacher. 
Okay. All right. So I want to hear your conversations. Okay, vamos a ver si se puede. I star. All right. Hi, Manuel. How are you? Fine. So happy in my new job. It's more difficult than the last job. No, it was training. Really? Is there a manual with procedures in the new year, the new work? Yes, Roberto coached me. Oh. Yes, I have two years working in the same company, but I think it would be better to update a manual procedures. Mm. What, what do you think this? Uh, first, the technology, the new technology is it's much, it's much better. Uh, uh, the almost times spend time a lot. Mm. It would be better to learn, use a new machine and save your energy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the new technology looking for in for apps and and YouTube. YouTube. All right. Okay. Just déjeme la un ratito. Hi Manuel, how are you? Um, fine. Solo error de dedo ahí donde dice I'm fine, verdad? Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. I'm so happy in my new job. Igual, it's more difficult than it. Okay, como es pregunta, Mariano, tendría que ser Is it more difficult than the last job? Is it, verdad? Le damos vuelta. No. Cuando dicen no, was training, ¿a qué se refieren? What do you mean? No, estuve en un, en un entrenamiento, una capacitación. Okay. Okay. Entonces, acuérdense, acuérdense que... I tú, was. Sí, la, el pronombre tiene que ir siempre. No, I was in a training. O no, I received a training. Cualquiera de las dos. Ok. No, I was training. Ok. I was in a training. Uh -huh. Ah, in a training. Estuve en una capacitación, ¿verdad? Estuve en un entrenamiento, ¿verdad? Así es, sí, sí. Uh -huh. Ok, o sea que prácticamente en, este, en esta situación aquí se... La, the translator is eh, think about to, to say in Spanish. Sí, ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, thank you, teacher. Yeah, thank you. Really? Is there a manual with procedures in your new in your new job? Sería mejor, um, Mariano. Yes, Roberto coach me. Como él lo entrenó, tendría que ser en pasado el coach. Y luego Roberto dice, Yes, I have two years working in the same. I've been all right, okay. I okay. I have two years working in the same company, but I think it would be better to update a manual procedures. Piense que en lugar de a manual quitémosle el a y pongámosle el da. The manual procedures, porque el a es uno y procedures son varios. Okay. All right. Uh, Ahí quítale el a y póngale el da. Ajá. First, the new technology is much better. The old machine is spent a lot of time. Dele vuelta, a lot of time. It would be better to learn to use. It would be better to learn how to use a new machine and save energy. Sin la aire. Ajá. All right. Okay, very good. Thank you, guys. Thank you, teacher. Yeah, it was nice. Thank you. Siempre salen primero. Ajá, uh -huh, Johnny. All right. Next group, Johnny. Ya me dijo el tres. Me falta el uno, dos, cuatro, cinco y seis. Number one. Number one, Debbie and Doris. Ah, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Debbie, you, ah, no, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Debbie, how are you? Uh, I'm great. And you, Doris? I'm fine, but a little tired. I need to check the works manual. Is there a manual with procedures in your workplace, Debbie? Yes, we have work manual. For example, a step number one is the in, in the manual is internal employees code. Do you think this manual can be improved? Because I'm because I will be better to change step number one. For example, I'm going to choose employees benefits. No, I think. <laughs> I think it will be better to addressing employees after, after that internal employees code. Okay, thanks, Debbie. Take care. You too, Doris. Bye. All right, very good. Subámosla, pongámosla desde el inicio. A ver, igual error de dedo donde dice I'm great. Mm. El spelling the great. G-R-E-A-T. Crea. ¿Dónde, dónde, dónde? Ahí, ahí. ¿Aquí? No, del great está mal escrito. Póngale una E antes de la A. Una Grea. 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 Ah, ah, ah. Y luego quítele ah. la última E. Ya. Yeah. Ok, I'm fine, but a little ah. tired. But a little tired or I am a little tired. No sé qué quisieron poner ahí. Pero but a little, uh, ah. que estoy cansada. But I'm, sería, ah. ¿verdad? But I'm, a, okay, but I'm a little tired, see? Uh, yeah, I need to check the works manual. All right. Is there a manual with procedures in your workplace, Debbie? Yes, we have works manual. For example, step number one in the manual is internal employees code. Póngale yes. la S yes. después de la S apostrofe. Después de la S, sí, ajá, porque es plural. Very good. Okay, okay. Yeah, very nice. Do you think this manual can be improved? Because I, because it would be better. Póngale después de because it. Because it, it. would be better to change. Change es con G, no con C. Change. <laughs> change. But... Number one, for example, I'm going to choose employees' benefits. Igual por pongo... el apóstrofe, el apóstrofe. <laughs> I think it would be better to address. Quítale el ing. Porque acuérdese que es infinitivo. Y ayer decíamos mm. que el infinitivo es el, el tú más el, el, verbo, uh, el verbo. To address employees after that internal employees. Code. Otra vez. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thanks, Debbie. Take care. You too, Doris. Bye. Yeah. Very nice. Thank you, lady. Okay. <laughs> All right. Johnny, continue, please. Group number one, finish. Group number three, finish. We have two, six. Four, five, six. Six. Okay. Um, Carlita. Bueno, Carlita creo que no podía participar. Leti and Gabby. I think Letty is going to share. Okay, perfect. Um, yes, they are. I would just answer the, the, the questions because in my job, there is not any manual. It's only in Letty's works. So uh, she said, yes, there are many manuals. It depends of the area. For example, she has one manual for uh, maritime and another one like uh, and another for love's costume. Uh, she said that it would better to add more procedure and explain explanations about the internal systems. Costume, in addition to that, how to avoid mistakes inside their company. Okay. All right. That's all. Okay, so you didn't do the the uh, conversation. You just answer the questions. Yes. No, we did a conversation, but uh, okay. we thought that it would do what was necessary just to answer the questions. Yeah. All right. That's okay. That's fine. Uh, Gabby, you don't have your manual in your in your platform. 
Uh, which manual? The one that we use every day, or you have it? Yeah, I have it. Oh, okay, all right, okay. I thought, okay, that's fine. Yes, I misunderstood. No, I said, I, I meant uh, the manual for my work. Oh, okay, I get it. <laughs> there are many manuals now. Very good, thank you, Gabby. All right, okay. All right. Okay. All right. Um, Johnny, another group. Okay. Number five. Number five. Johnny, usted es el cuatro. <laughs> <laughs> Danny, Vanessa, and Walter. Okay. Walter, please share the screen. Okay. Hello, Walter. How are you? Hi, Daniel. I'm fine. You? Fine. Uh, uh, did you go to training yesterday? Yes. In my work, I will see a training about new machine. Has the machine a manual procedure for using it? Yes. The technician gave me a manual and described every step how to use the machine. First charter is about Jose A and Pop Room. Next, the manual explain all about security consideration when you use the machine. Yes, I read it. I read the manual. Uh, I think it will be better to modify. Do you think the manual can be improved? Yes, I would be better to move the second charter about security it's the more important, is the more principal topic in the manual and should be the first. Yes, I think it will be better to modify the manual. Okay, thanks, Daniel, for your recommendation. Okay, nice to see you. Bye. All right. Bye, Daniel. Very nice. All right. Hey, Walter, how are you? Hi, Daniel. I'm fine. And you? Fine. Did you go to the training yesterday? Yes. In my work, I received, como estamos hablando de ayer, I received the training about a new about new machine. Has the machine? Ah, donde dice Daniel, has the machine tendría que ser. Does the machine have a manual procedure to use it? Does the machine? Does does the the auxiliar does do it does d o e s ah. does the machine? Uh huh. Do it. Do it. Uh -huh. Does uh, the machine have? Uh, a manual procedure to use it. No for, sino que to. Yes, the technician gave me, pasado gave me a manual in it. Okay, it describes every step, it describes every step. To, uh, steps. Okay, how to use the machine. First chapter is about how to, how to set up and put it to run. How to set up and put it to run. Uh-huh, two. Next, the manual explains all, all about security consideration when you use the machine. Yes, I read the manual. Quítele el it. O quítele el manual, o decimos, I read it, or I read I the read manual. It. I read it, uh -huh. I read the manual. I think it would be better. I, I think, think it would be better to modify. Do you think the manual can be improved? Yes, it would be better. I, uh -huh. It would be better to move the second chapter about security. It's the more principal topic in the manual and should be the first. Yes, I think it would be better to modify the manual. Uh-huh. Okay, thanks, Daniel, for your recommendation. Okay, nice to see you, bye, bye. All right, nice, I like it, thank you. All right, what other group, Johnny, porque presiento que no va a elegir el cuatro. <laughs> no, no, number four. Number four, all right, thank you. All right, so Johnny, Ever, and Carlos. Oh, 
Uh, I don't know, Carlos. You or me? Carlos. Yo, hello. Escuchan. Sí. Ok. Eh, ever, voy a seguir. I am Johnny. Okay. okay. Good evening, Never. How are you? Hi, Johnny. Everything okay in you? I'm okay too. In my workplace, I have a convivence manual. Is there a manual with the procedures in your workplace? Yes, I have. Do you think this manual can be improved? I think I will better to change all product quality verification produce. Really? Give me an example, please. For example, it will better be better to write the documentation about validation of the certification like uh, ISO. Uh, nine nine hundred nine nine thousand. Nine thousand. Clicka, teacher, how do you mean? Uh, or or nine or nine thousand one. Okay. Okay. Thanks. All right. Very good. good Excellent. Evening. Thank you. Um. Okay. Two in my workplace. I I have a. Uh, Johnny, Ever, and Carlos. What is Convivence manual. Manual de convivencia. Ah. Okay. Okay. Is there a manual with the procedures in your workplace? Yes. Okay. Acuérdese que ahí hicieron una pregunta con is there. Entonces contestamos con yes, there is. Porque se le pregunta hay. Entonces le contesto si hay. Yes, there is. All right. Do you think this manual can be improved? Yes. I think it would be better to change some product quality verification procedures. Really? Give me an example, please. For example, it would be better to review the documentation about the validation or certification like, wow, guys, very technical. <laughs> Excellent. Very nice. Thank you, Johnny. Thank you, Evera. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you. All right. So last but not least, Nos falta group number two. Jorge, Domingo, and Trini. Okay. Alexander va a presentar. Okay. Permítame. Yes. Okay. I see. Mm -hmm. Yes, I can see it. Is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? Yes, we have a general manual, the workplace complex, complex. Compliance. Compliance, compliance, okay. What is the procedure? Uh, first, be punctual. Second, sanity letter trace code. Assigning the jobs. Checking the kick of tour. Uh, for material, finally, finally, check the self, self, safety? Safety, safety? In, uh, safety in the workplace, the two prevention of acid. Do you think this manu manual can be improved? improved? Good, yes, Trini, very nice. Yes. I saw a word, it's better to choose 
the step. the steps all right very good i like the picture of the background <laughs> all right mm -hmm. first be punctual second sanitize donde dice second um domingo póngale sanit sanity se sanitize no sanitizing sanitize ajá con z e quítele el ing y póngale la e Sanitize, yes. Um, no, quítele la I, solo póngale la E. Sanity. 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 Sanitize. Oh my goodness, creo que es by C. Luego después ponga later, solo con una T. Assign the jobs, check the kit of tools, ask for material, finally check the safety in the workplace to prevent. Abajo, en lugar de poner to prevention, only to prevent. To prevent accidents, nada más. Quítele el off. To prevent. Ahí. Quítele la I. ¿Ah? Yo voy, Daniel. Quítele la I N. Prevent. Hasta la T déjelo. Ah, ok. Y quítele el off. Dígame, Daniel. Eh, pudiera ser una opción to avoid accidents. Sí, también. Okay. Prevent Thank accidents you. or to avoid accidents. Sí, cualquiera. Okay. Thank All right. You. Very good. Thank you, guys. Excellent. Um, very good, Trini. Thank you, Domingo. All right. Okay. So, excellent, guys. We're going to continue. I'm going to take attendance y seguimos con el nuevo eh, tema que nos corresponde ahora. Adela Trinidad González Consuegra. Present. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Present. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Debbie Jasmine Girón Ramírez. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Present teacher. Carla Benacir Lara González. Leticia Guadalupe, thank you, Carita. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Thank uh, present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Present teacher. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. María Gabriela Batres Mármol. Present. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemus. Present. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Vismar Ulises Present Martínez teacher. Ortiz. Thank you. Vismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Present teacher. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Julio César Vega. Present teacher. Thank you. And Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Present. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. All right, guys. Okay. So let's continue here. Con eso cerramos esas actividades que teníamos con el It Would Be Better y con lo de eh, los manuals, all right, and the steps. Let's continue now with page 23. I will be able to. A ver, Avani, uh, can you read this, please? I will be able to. I will be able to design a basic checklist to evaluate. A so pro evaluate, procedure. Evaluate. Evaluate. Mm -hmm. Evaluate the procedure. Very good. Thank you. Number one. Let's see. Vismar, can you read number one? Let's start. Uh, is there a quality quality department in your workplace? Okay. Do they monitor and eval evaluate? Uh, e evaluate. Evaluate your procedure. Excellent, very nice. Okay, now, guys, is there a quality department in your workplace? Voy a dejar de compartir. Is there a quality department in your workplace? Yes or no? Yes, teacher, in my workplace, yes, we have a quality yes. department. Okay, very good. What about in, um, I don't know, um, Mariano? Yes, teacher. Is there a quality department in your workplace? No, teacher. No? 
No. So nobody checks the quality? No, teacher. Uh, every uh, person evaluates the quality of the work. All right, okay. <laughs> Gabby, is there a um, quality control department in your company? No, but the boss is like monitorizing us like all the time and hearing what we say and how we talk, the, our vocabulary, our vestment, our dress, and everything. And let's he makes the the monetizing, okay. but there's not any department. All right, but he's the the quality. <laughs> okay, all right. So he checks the quality. Very good, Johnny. In the school, do you have a quality department? Uh in my school, it uh, calls you calls uh -huh. coordination. A coordination, department. yes. Okay, yeah, and they check the quality, right? Yes. Yes. All right. Very good. What about in Vanessa's job? Do you have a quality control department or department? Uh huh. Yes, teacher, because it is a fabrica production. Uh huh. It's a factory. How do you say? Uh, yeah, yes, it's a factor. Okay. Yeah, so you need to have one. <laughs> yes. Yes. All right. Very good. Doris, what about in your workplace? Do you have a quality department? Yes, there is in the production plant. Ah, okay. Very nice. Very good. Ever in your company? Hi, teacher. Hi. Is there we a. We have. No? A... So uh, I, I am the department, the quality department. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> very good, Ever. Very nice. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. Linda, in your workplace, is there a quality department? Um, I work in a headquarter and there isn't, but in the fabric, yes, there is a quality department. Okay, all right, in the factories. Okay, very good. Uh, factory. Yes, mm -hmm. okay, good. Leti, what about you? In your workplace, is there a quality department? Yes, in an agency logistic. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right, very nice, interesting. Manuel, what about you? Quality department in your company? No teacher, it's I only I only employees in my in my job and my old job is the company have a quality department. Okay. And sometimes I I watch I watch the the procedure the procedures and the procedures. Yes, very nice. Thank you. All right. What about Walter in your company? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. There are a quality department okay. to analyze our okay. material to receive. Okay, perfect. Very good. Thank you, Walter. All right, very good. So let's continue then. The second question was, uh, let me see here. The second question we have is, do they monitor and evaluate your procedures? So I guess for the people that said yes, that they have a quality department, I guess this quality department controls or monitors and evaluates the procedures, the way things are being done, all right? So number two here, we have complete the satisfaction survey. A survey is an encuesta, okay? That's a survey using the words in the box, all right? So here we have seated, Dishes, acuérdense que estamos siempre con la restaurant industry, the food industry. Seated, dishes, dining, taking, and server. All right, ahorita, individual, aquí en el grupo grande nos quedamos. Llene los espacios que nos hacen falta with these words. Vaya leyendo and complete it. Y luego we talk about it. Let me know when you're finished. Unos dos minutitos.
All right, are we finished? Yes, it is. All right, very good. All right, so number one, let me see here. Um, Domingo, can you read number one? Ya con la palabra que you chose, please. We. We were taking pro, probably, promptly, promptly. Promptly. Puso take? Take. Take. Mm, all right. What take. about that? Okay. Veamos los demás. The rest of you guys. Is it okay? No. I uh, put we group. were seat, seated. That's correct. Seated. The pronunciation. Seated. seated. Yes. We were seated. Seated, seated promptly. promptly. Yes. Very nice. We were seated. Sería en ese caso, Domingo. Okay. Okay. Very nice. Let's see. Number two. Um. Letty, can you do number two? Okay, teacher. The server was there to take our order quickly. Yes, very good. The server was there to take our order quickly. Very good. Roberto, can you do number three? Okay. Um... The server was friendly and patent, but patent when taking our order. Yes, when taking our order. Very nice. Thank you. All right. Um, let me see here. Danny, can you go on with number four? Four. Okay. Our server coordinates the timing of the dishes perfectly. Very nice. Thank you. All right, Manuel, can you go on with number five? No lo he terminado, teacher. Ah, pero esa no te, no, solo, no había que ponerle nada, Manuel, solo le habla. Okay, the server was able to answer all our questions. Very good. Ever, can you go with number six? Uh, overall, the service was excellent. Very nice, all right. Um, Walter, can you do number seven? Consider, considering, considering everything or dining experience was a good value. All right, considering everything, our dining experience was a good value. All right, very good. Okay, thank you guys. So number one is we were seated promptly. Number two, the server was there to take our order quickly. Number three, the server was friendly and patient when taking our order. Four, our server coordinated the timing of the dishes perfectly. Five, there, the server was able to answer all of our questions. Six, overall, the service was excellent. Seven, considering everything, our dining experience was a good value. All right, now, to Cecilia, then we have a strongly disagree, disagree, agree, or strongly agree. Sorry. <laughs> All right. So for example, sorry guys, for example, we were seated promptly. Piensa en la última experiencia que, que usted tuvo cuando fue a comer a algún lado, desde que fue a la cafetería enfrente de su trabajo o a un nice beautiful restaurant o a la pupusería, no importa. All right, piensa en esa experiencia. A strongly disagree es cuando usted dice no nope, para nada de acuerdo. Número dos, disagree, desacuerdo, agree, estoy de acuerdo. Y la cuatro, súper de acuerdo. All right. En que su, el, we were seated promptly. Usted está de acuerdo que sí lo sentaron rápido y le dieron mesa rapidito en la pupusería, aparte que estaba llena. Yes or no. All right. So answer this based on the last experience that you had in a restaurant. 
or a cafeteria? Me avisan cuando lo termine. And we include my experience in a fast food, McDonald's. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> McDonald's, okay. pollo, pizza, pupuseria. Okay. Carnitas, no importa, anything. McDonald's because my, 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 my son uh, request, me, uh, requ request me the Happy Meals. Oh, <laughs> Happy Meals are... Yes. Are good for kids. <laughs> they like them. Finished, teacher. All right. What about the rest of you guys? Finished? Yes, teacher. Okay. All right. Let's see. Um, Mariano, what do you have for number one? I strongly disagree, disagree, agree, or strongly agree? Disagree. <gasps> disagree oh okay all right what about number two mariano I strongly agree oh okay number three agree okay four <laughs> no, let's... agree okay number five, five. agree okay six agree okay and seven agree. and seven Agree. Agree. Okay. All right. So pasaron el examen en ese restaurante. Very good. Linda. <laughs> Linda, what about you? Number one for you, Linda. One, two, three, or four. Um, one, agree. Two, agree. Okay. Three, strongly agree. All right. And four agree. All right. Okay. Very nice. Johnny, what do you have for this one? Okay. The number one agree. Mm -hmm. And two, 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 seven strongly agree. Ah, oh, two through seven is strongly agree. Oh, super, uh, Johnny. Very nice. Okay. All right, Manuel, what about you? Number one, <laughs> uh, disagree. Okay. Number number two, agree. Mm -hmm. Number three, agree. Okay. Number four, number four, disagree. Okay. Number six, agree. Number six, six, agree. In number seven, agree. All right. So most of it is it's like that. All right. It seems like most of you guys have had a good experience at a restaurant. So that's very nice. Okay. To finish up, all right, we are going to create a survey. All right. Similar to this, but... Por la hora, vamos a tener nada más cinco puntos in our survey. All right, no seven como este que está aquí. But what I want you to think, y usted puede aquí poner igual, strongly disagree, disagree, agree, or strongly agree. O puede poner otra escala que usted quiera. All right. Um, puede ser de caritas felices nada más, like a happy, very happy face, a so-so face, a sad face, and an angry face, for example. All right. Lo vamos a hacer pensando ahora en algo que usted recientemente ha comprado. All right. Entonces, para empezar, tienen que discutir en su grupo qué. All right. Si Debbie no ha comprado nada, Johnny no ha comprado nada, yo compré, por decirle algo, um, un reloj. Entonces, yo les cuento, ¿verdad? Entonces, decimos, ah, bueno, pensamos en la venta, pensamos cómo nos fue, cómo nos trataron en ese lugar, si estaba el producto que quería. Ustedes piensen en los cinco puntos que van a evaluar. All right, yes. 
So let's go, guys. Escojan un producto, una venta que usted, algo que ustedes hayan comprado. ¿Y cómo les fue ahí? Pensando en eso, hacemos cinco puntos que vamos a evaluar de ese lugar donde hayamos comprado. Vamos a seguir trabajando en los mismos grupos para no perder más tiempo. ¿Ok? Let's go. Igual lo pueden hacer en compu mejor para, lo, para que lo compartamos. Linda, ahorita la voy a unir a un grupo, Linda, oye. Ok, teacher. Okay. Igual a mí, teacher, por favor. Ahorita Vicky, sí. Vicky, la voy a unir a la sala 2, Vicky. Bismar, no, puede, no sé si puede participar. Eh, yes, teacher. Ok, ahorita lo mando. Thank you. Ok, Bismar.
All right, did you girls finish, Linda, Doris? Yeah? Yes. All right, let's see, let's, let's, um, everybody's coming back. Did everybody finish? Were you able to finish your work? Yes? Yes, teacher. All right, very nice. Okay, let's see, Linda, Doris, and um, Debbie, do you have it so you can share it so I can see it quickly? All right, Simon is the uh, okay. Teacher, antes tenemos una duda. Sí, sí, lo correcto es porch, buy o shop. Eh, depende de qué quiere decir. Compra. <risa> sí, compra. 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 Purchase. Ajá. Purchase. Entonces, purchase. purchase. Aquí, Ajá. I, I, S. No, A, S, I. Purchase. 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 No. La A, S, I, E. A es exacto. Purcha. Purcha. A. A S E. Ajá. Espérense, espérense, espérense. A S E. Así. Sí. sí. All right. Y, so, Simon es store. Ajá, purchase of a stove. Very good. The uh -huh. seller's stove. Sí, es la estufa. Sí. O sea, la ah, cocina okay. que nosotros decimos. Ajá. Ajá, teníamos esa duda también. Sí. sí. Oh, ok. Acuérdense. Eh, no. que kitchen es el lugar es donde. El está. cuarto. Ajá, the room. Ajá. Ajá. Ok, number one, the sellers, the sellers were friendly and polite, and Debbie said strongly disagree. Oh my goodness, ok. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the other one, the product was in good condition, condition Debbie said disagree. Oh, oh ok. And the sellers give the sellers give you a discount in the product. I agree. Okay. And the store was able to resolve the inco the inconvenient. I agree. And consider considering the purchase experience was good. Disagree. Oh no! Yo que voy a comprar una en serio. <laughs> Gracias. ¿A dónde? ¿A dónde? ¿Qué compraron? ¿Qué compraron? Store purchase of a stove. Ah, ok. Ese, ese, ese. This seller is not win the commission. Oh, no. All right. Ok. All right. Inconvenient. Inconvenience. En donde dice the store was able to resolve the inconvenience. 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 Yes. No, quítele la T, la S, la T, y póngale C, E. C, E. Sí, inconvenience, yes. Inconvenience. Yes. All right, very good. Oh, nice. Okay, I like it. Thank you. Okay. All right. Okay, guys, it's one minute to 10 o'clock. I'm going to take attendance igual. Seguimos mañana porque si necesito ver los, um, los, los surveys que ustedes lograron hacer. All right, mañana vamos a ir en orden. Solo déjeme tomar la foto igual para que nadie se me escape. All right. Here we have, oops, that's not the picture. Okay, and we also have... All right, perfect. Okay, Adela Trinidad González con suegra. Present. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Presente. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. <coughs> Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Debbie Jasmine Girón Ramírez. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present teacher. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Carla Present Benazir, teacher. Thank you. Carla Lara González. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Present teacher. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. María Gabriela Batres Mármol. 
Present. Mariano Jose Paca Santa Maria. Present teacher. Lin, eh, 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 permítame. Vanessa Noemi Reyes Lemos. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Bismar Ulises. Present teacher. Thank you. Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Present teacher. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Julio. Present teacher. Thank you. So, Julio César Vega Aguilar. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Present. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. A ver, Leti, no sé si se puede quedar un ratito, Leti. Sí, teacher. All right, very good. Thank you. Los demás nos retiramos. Nos vemos mañana. Bye, guys. Thank teacher, you. Bye. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. You too. Good night. Bye, Debbie. Bye, teacher. Aha, Leti, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. <laughs> Leti, where do you live? Um, Planet de Renderos. Excuse me? I live in Planet de Renderos. Ah, okay, yeah, you live here in San Salvador. All right, that's nice. Okay. All right, very good. Um, Leti, I don't know if you have any questions about what we have studied so far in the classes or any question whatsoever about English. No, teacher, really, I understand the grammar, only I have problem with pronunciation and in some case and the new word. Okay. So I, I had to find the, the meaning. The meaning, okay. The meaning, mm -hmm. All right, very good. No, you're doing very well, Letty, actually. Yes, you're doing really, really mm -hmm. well and, and you participate, so that's very good. So yeah, all right. Well, with the platform, Letty, how are you doing? Everything okay? Um, when I, in my free time, I try to to finish. I finish the uni one, and uh, today I start to to unit two. Okay. I I'm going to to finish tomorrow. So. Okay. Uh, I try to give a uh, study. All right, you try to be up to date, yes. Mm -hmm. All right, Letty, very good. Well, if you don't have any questions or anything, I will let you go so you rest. <laughs> and you rest and only teacher, so look in occasionally, I estoy de oyente, no sé cómo se dice. See, you're as a listener. Uh -huh. In the in the in the study in the beginning of the class, okay. Because I had to attend my baby, so I had to to, yeah, to sleep. Okay. Uh huh. All right. how <laughs> but old I, I listen. I listen. Yes, the, I know. And the, how, the class. how old is your baby? Uh huh. Uh, ten months. Two months. No, ten months. Ah, uh, ten months. I'm like, oh no. Uh -huh. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Okay, no, that's okay. I understand, Letty. Don't worry. Okay. Thank All right. You. Very good. Okay. Thank you for being in class, Letty, and thank you for for being like I don't know, like dedicada to this. All right. <laughs> you're you're doing really well. I try to do the 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 uh, the work the uh, the homework and so. I, I try to practice. Yeah, of course, and you're doing really well, Letty. Okay, excellent. Okay, thank you. All right, very good. Go go back to your baby. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> okay, teacher. All right. So, okay, tengo que me, I I will be better to to vocabulary and um, articulator in the pronunciation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you I know have what, difficult. You know what you can do, Letty. Keep on listening. Listening is going to improve your vocabulary and your pronunciation, but you're doing really well. Uh, I try to, yeah, I, yeah, to do better. Yes, of course. Yeah, yeah. you're doing great. I okay. Un poquito más de de inglés por ahí, but yeah, eso le va a ayudar a seguir mejorando. Okay, teacher. All Thank right. you. Very good, Leti. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye now.